2024 Paris Olympics. The 18.4 kilometers finishing circuit of the cycling road races features a Menarder cobbled climb key. This may be a key point for securing victory. The men and women got a chance to see the finishing circuit, which passes the Moulin Rouge, Menarder, and the Sopraker Church. They also got a taste of the Parisian cobbles, which could play a factor in deciding the medal winners in the men's, August 3rd, and the women's, August 4th, road races. The cobbles climb from the Moulin Rouge to Menarder and in the fast descent below Sopraker are considered to be the decisive point in the race, where attacks could be launched and groups get away before a fight for the medal at the finish line a few kilometers away, across the pond and a bridge between the Eiffel Tower and the Trocadero. The circuit was closed for two hours between 4 and 6 p.m. on Thursday. The riders agreed to ride around the circuit together at an average speed of 30 kilometers per hour. They were able to test their legs at race speed on the climb on subsequent laps. Watt, U. van der Poel opted against the control tree con ride and trains with his Netherlands teammates in a quieter country roads to the west of Paris. Most other riders completed several laps, including time trial gold medalist from Kulitva Poel, Kasha Nuliadoma, and Matthias Jorgensen and Chloe Thierry. Sin van der Inhout said, it looks the route of a Flemish classic. There's no need to tell you that our Belgian riders will like it, but not just them. It will be important to start the climb in a good position because it's difficult to move back up. There is room for three riders at the most across the road. The classics riders are used to this kind of terrain, but it will be a key point of the race. The cobbles are not as rough as, say, the Koppenberg climb, but they are not smooth either. The Belgo climb is about five kilometers before Menmora and is climbed at five percent for a kilometer. It could be a good place to make an attack. It's followed by a flat section rather than a descent, so riders can push on there. It reminds me of the climb where Julian Lagalip attacked during the 2021 World in Leuven. Perhaps it is where the medals will be decided. 90 rider men's entry list includes Edna Powell, Bad Vannert, Van der Poel and Jorgensen, but also Julian Lagalip, Tom Pitcock, Mads Pedersen, Minnie Ambermay and Michael Matthews from Australia. All are potential medal winners. Mata Becky, Elise Longo-Bargini, Kasha Nui-Adoma, Lauren Weaves, Demi Ballering, Marianne Vaux and U.S. rider Chloe Diggert, but it is unclear if she has recovered from her time trial crash. The men race for a total of 273 kilometers, while the women face 158 kilometers, both with a long loop into the rolling French countryside to the southwest of Paris. The men and women return to the city with 60 kilometers to race, passing by the Louvre on the way to the finishing circuit. It will mark the start of the final of both races. The speed will rise. When they see the Moulin Rouge, the riders turn right and to roll a peak to begin the key climb. The narrow road will create a bottleneck, and positioning will be important. Minardera is climbed with 46 kilometers, then 28 kilometers, and finally 9.5 kilometers to go. The road climbs up for a kilometer on urban French cobbles. They are smoother than the cobbles of Paris Roubaix but are still cobbles, and so impact the ability to put down power. The first section of the climb passes the Café de du Moulin. The road then curves around the side of the hill, reaching the peak of Minardera, close to the place du Terra. The roads are narrow and will be packed with spectators. The round descends in front of the step of the Sockraker Church for the rest of the 18.4 kilometer circuit, which is covered twice. After the third climb of Montmartre, the route returns to the Louvre and then follows the south bank of the Seine to the finish. The Montmartre climb is decisive, but Van der Inhout and others warned of other key points on the circuit that could be perfect to launch a decisive attack, including a two kilometer climb at 4% near the Chateau Rouge Park. There are more cobbles along Rue du Faubourg du Temple and several sharp corners, while there is a short but steep section near the metro station. The circuit is harder than the circuit used for the world in Wollongong, Australia, but easier than the 2023 Glasgow City Centre Circuit. Thanks, legends, and I'll hope you are all well. Don't miss a moment from the sports that you follow. Help bring us the best content possible. Subscribe, share, like, comment, and vote in the community polls.